I'm Ian Campbell inside the arrivals gate at YYC Calgary International Airport where a good chunk of our Canadian athletes have been returning home from Pyeongchang. Now a good deal of them live here. They call Southern Alberta home while others here call this their second home using the 1988 facilities to train in their athletic endeavors. These winter games have been a record setter for Team Canada. Olympians are returning with 29 medals. That's 11 gold, 8 silver and 10 bronze. And while we didn't do so well in our traditional favoured sports like curling or hockey, we excelled on the slope and the luge track. The previous record haul was 26 at the Vancouver Games. Snowboarder Sebastian Tutin, freestyle skiers Michael Kingsbury, Cassie Sharp, Kelsey Sirwa, just a few of the gold medal winners. Also two-man bobsleigh Calgarian Justin Cripps. It's amazing, it's wild. There's tons of people here and uh, we're, we're off a pretty long travel day right now, but um, couldn't think of a better way to get back to Canada. I mean, the experience was fantastic. Being able to come home to this Calgary, I'm born and raised from here. So being able to come back to Calgary, to be able to share this with other Calgarians and, and with Canada is, is truly special. Reception like this is amazing. I mean, we knew we had a, a ton of support uh, back home, but to see it you know, coming down the escalator here is, is really something special. To see everyone jammed into such a small area is really, there's no words for it. Just the COC's messaging for the 2018 team was be virtuous, be victorious, be Olympic, and Olympic they were in terms of medal hall. Many of them looking forward to seeing if Calgary will put forward a 2026 bid. Also hopefully maybe we'll see about uh, being part of the, the bid committee for 2026 because it'd be a lot of fun to, uh, to carry some of the excitement from these games and, and being a legacy child from the 88 games, bringing that, uh, that into that, uh, that world. The COC pays $20,000 to the athletes for every gold medal, $15,000 for silver and $10,000 for bronze. This year's total payout will be $1,285,000. Ian Campbell, City News, Calgary.